we're in the gym, we are in the gym. You know, I mean, we laugh and we joke, but we work. We work hard in the gym every day. When Jazzy first came to the gym, I was excited she came, but then I saw her do gymnastics and I started to panic a little bit. And I was just thinking like, oh, I hope I did not make a mistake, you know. She just kept working in the gym and she was trying so hard. So I was like, you know what, like, I'll give her a chance, we'll see what happens. I'll put her out there. I just knew like that she could like get me to what I wanted to do. I just knew I had to be there. A year ago, if someone told me that I was gonna win, I wouldn't believe them because like I just think it's crazy. After Lori came back, we went to the May training camp and that was bad. I noticed her knees were starting to grow like kind of in a weird way, like her knees were touching but her feet weren't touching. It was my first double full of the week. I landed short and twisting into the ground and I felt something pop on my knee. Wait, what? Like, surgery? Like, what do you mean surgery? Like, this is serious, you know, we have to take care of this. It was pretty disappointing to know that, like, you know, I have another injury. There are ups and downs in gymnastics, but just know that you can overcome it and will come back stronger than ever. Sometimes I look at them like, they're crazy, like this is so hard, you know, and they come back the next day. I wouldn't have as much fun coaching if I didn't have these girls who are so willing to buy in to, you know, to the process and so willing to work so hard. It's like hard when you're just training by yourself. So when I have like Erin and Lori with me, it just it helps me out a lot. When you're down and like you need like help, like they're always there to help you up and they always cheer you on. We each just have something special and we're always trying to help each other out.